Hey everybody, it's the Electrocutioner. Welcome back to Batman Arkham Origins. In the last episode, we went to the Siona Steel Mill and we fought Copperhead there and she told us that the Joker is holding a meeting and all the assassins will be there. And we used the electromagnetic signal from Electrocutioner's gloves and tracked him to the Gotham Royal Hotel. And we also did all the weapon, the weapons, or the arms crates from Penguin. And we got the ability to disable uh, weapon boxes to make it to where, so we can make it to where guys can't get weapons. So that'll be useful here. In this episode, we're going to be going through the Gotham Royal Hotel, the Gotham Royal Hotel, all in one episode. So get comfortable, because it's going to be a long one. Alright, let's get started. Alright, so first things first, we're gonna head in here to the valet parking. And we're going to get this data pack. Car crash. Lovely. Alright, there's file 15, 1 out of 10 found. I think file 15 is just in the hotel, I don't know. take down and we're going to disable this weapon box so they can't get guns out of there and we're going in so yeah count them come on really what the heck happened there really Alright, they're trying to get the guns and they can't because it's locked. So yeah, pretty cool guys. Pretty cool upgrade there. I don't think it's as good as the um, the real ammo. I don't think it's as good of an upgrade as that, but it's still pretty good to disable the weapon boxes. Alright, let's get this guy. I actually managed to hit him there. Well... Man, sometimes you can just straight up hit him, but most of the time, most of the time you can't. And bye bye. Nice. All right, so yeah, disabling the weapon box will come in handy in this in this area. And Royal Hotel. I don't know why, but this is my favorite part of the game. I can't tell you why, but it, it just is. I, I like this part a lot. Let's shut off the electricity there. And come up. Start main generator. All right, going up. the security room. Okay, this is about 15, 2 out of 10. There are enough explosives here to take down this building. Wonder what other surprises I'll find. You will find a stealth section. I can tell you that much. Yes, me. 
Alright, let's get this guy here. That should knock him out. It did indeed. There's a jammer. The heck? Alright, the jammer's right there. Let's hook this guy up. Let's hook that guy up. That ain't gonna hang him up, but it will still knock him out. Alright, and hang this guy up. Whee! That looks fun. So looks like there's four guys left. The jammer and those three guys over there. Now you can temporarily disable the jammer. You can just temporarily disable the jammer. But yeah, he'll he'll get it back up. No. He'll get it back up eventually. It won't take him very long to do so. Alright. Invade takedown? Vertic takedown, not invade takedown. I almost said invade takedown. Alright, three more guys to go. Alright, let me set up this guy's jammer real fast so I can see how many guys there are left. Oh, really? Alright, I'm back to where I was. I, I hung the three guys up again. And there's four left. Now, hmm, I could drop behind this guy right now, but I don't know if that's safe. Nah, not really. I mean, I could, I guess. Hmm, I don't know if I don't know if I should though. I definitely could do that. I should. Man, if that guy wasn't right there, I could hang this guy up, probably. Well, then again, probably not. His goggles on? No, he doesn't. I think. The freaking thermo vision goggles are the worst. They can see you hiding up on the gargoyles. Yeah. <sighs> so annoying, dude. Can't see if anything's anybody's there though. That guy wasn't right there. We can hit him and then take him out. Alright, we hit that guy with the battering and then did an averted takedown on the other guy. Who knows? You think you can take him head on? Time to show the boss who the real fighters are. Red, and keep your eyes over your head. All right, let's disable his gem real fast. And smoke pellet.
Alright. Enter the security room and look for the Joker. Here we are. The security room. It's also the reception. What do we got here? I spy. Okay. Gain access to the security room. Friends, assassins, welcome to our first quarterly performance review. As you can see here, Batman deaths are coming in far below projections. <laughs> Just who the hell are you? I'm the guy with the money. And the gun. Oh, dang. should get me up to the ceiling so I can get out of here. Maybe electrocutioner's shock gloves could restore power to this platform. Okay, guys. We now have the shock gloves. The most powerful weapon in Arkham Origins. Probably in the entire Arkham series. They're that dang powerful. Yeah. Very cool. Before we get access to the penthouse, well, we won't do that for a while. Training, training challenge, shot gloves, expert. Now it's map checking out. Alright. Challenge, challenge campaign, legacy. Alright, we can charge this up. Character profile updated, electrocutioner. Now it will say, now it will say he's, a uh, um, deceased. Alright, you not only use the shot gloves to charge the stuff up, you can also use them in combat. Which, you have to charge them up by hitting people, but... You know, they are really powerful weapons once you get them charged up. No, oh, come on, really? And you need the shot gloves, I swear. Get out of my face. Oh, come on, really? Alright, R and L to activate. And let's deliver the beatdown. Now 
And the shot gloves even allow you to punch through shields and stuff like that, so it's really cool. And see ya. There you go. All right, so we have Joker and the and Bane's waiting on us at the top floor there, which we have to fight him three times in this game. File 16, one out of ten found. Oh, earlier we got three out of ten for for file 15. So yeah, early we have to fight Bane three times in this game, three times, and each fight is harder than the last. Anyways, we're at the elevator shaft here. And goodbye, I guess. Charge us up. And we're going for a ride. See you. Alright. Man, I tried to do the Blade Dodge shake down there. And you freaking know it, game. You freaking know I tried to do that. Whatever. Still gonna beat these guys down. And bye bye. Now there should be a thing. Yeah. It's all 16, 2 out of 10. And drop down. in the overview bar. Where is that? The suspended bar between the towers. Alright, let's level up and fix our problem from earlier. Let's get the heat signature concealment system. Where if they scan you on the gargoyles, as long as you stay still, they won't be able to see you. And that will fix our little problem from earlier where I had to cut. Because I, you know, they scanned the gargoyle and I was there. Yeah. So that'll fix that problem. There's an overview bar, and there's a roller coaster. Interesting. Now, we nah. All right, Do that, and we're going to zip line. And say good night. Oh, Batman, hurry! Someone's about to get shot. Disable that gun. And you. charge up. Oh come on! What was 
that. Nope. Hey. Okay. Then try to save my shot gloves for that dude. Okay, they go down real easily. Uh. Never mind, I guess. Cause they make the armored guys. You don't have to stun the armored guys with shot gloves on. So yeah, um, the shot gloves activated, the armored guys, you just have to, uh, or the, yeah, the armored guys, you just have to punch them, you don't have to stun them, with the shot gloves activated. It's pretty cool. Well, we'll, gotcha. We'll, we'll discover that later. So yeah, Brandon still thinks he's working with Black Mask. He still doesn't know that, guys. It's crazy. Yeah, he does. Yeah, doesn't know it's Joker. He'll find out that it's Joker later. But uh, for now, nah. And take a nap. Or still keep talking, I guess. Whatever. Let's get really close to this fan. How Enigma got a data pack there, I will never know. Alright. I don't, I don't know how Riddler gets Riddler trophies in some places. I don't know how Enigma got, got a data pack there. I have no clue. Alright, West Tower, 25th floor. I don't know how many floors there are, but... Yeah. And come here. All right. Joker sleigh ride. And welcome to the main attraction, the ballroom. Downs charge up your shot gloves faster, just FYI. We should be about good. Alright, shot gloves? We just punch the armored dudes now. You don't have to stun them with the shot gloves activated, you just punch them. And I love down doing beat downs with these on. And that's it. And get away from me. Thank you. Nice. Okay. When these lights, when these orange lights light up, then you hit them with the battering about two or three times. And then it becomes a grapple point. You can hook. Really? I did not select the. Really? I did not select the smoke pellet, and I did not mean to put the freaking explosive jar right there. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? I did not select the smoke pellet, and I did did not put the 
Knock knock. I did not put the uh, explosive gel there. Like what the heck, man? So yeah. This freaking game sometimes, I swear. What's this? It's not visor. Let's see. Surprise. Alright. That's not an access door, but alright. File 16, 4 out of 10 found. Remote control battering. Throw it fly through the electricity. And hit the button. Out one eye, in the other. Yeah, I would like to see you try to get Batman's utility belt. Yeah, good luck. All right. All right. Just hit the balloons in the order they light up. There you go. You just hit the balloons in the order they light up. Pretty simple. Really? I didn't mean to do that. Really? Yeah, just don't let me do a glide kick game. That's that's fine. Totally reasonable there. Alright, there's an enforcer, as you can see with your own eyes. What happened there? Please tell me. He did not, he did not hit me. But yeah, there's an enforcer, you can see that with your own eyes. He's much easier with the shot gloves as well. As you can imagine. Really, Batman? Really? Are you serious right now? Whatever. Activate the shot gloves. And let's get them. Nice. Much easier. And you're done. Nice. Got him. Do this. All right. Hello. There is a data pack, pack over there, but we'll go. We'll get that when we get the other ones here. All right, West Tower, twenty fifth floor. Bye bye. Who are you? I'm here to help. There are more of them. They have my co-workers. They're they're forcing them. Don't worry. Them before anything happens. Okay. Man, Hurry. all these hotel employees look the exact same. <laughs> they look the exact same. The bat ain't showing up. You all right the ice cream guy? They're not twins yeah, as far as I know. So I don't know. There's fall seventeen. Now you 
might as well get the gunman here. Alright, take down. Yep, this guy. And we saw this enforcer. Well, we saw an enforcer like this. And maybe it's the same one. Where you have to get off his armor before you can attack him. It might be the... Oh, okay, no. I thought we were doing a special combo to take down to that regular guy, but... We use the special combo takedown to take his armor off. Now, you can either get his armor off by doing a special t combo takedown or a beatdown. Whatever you prefer. Come on. He's gonna hit me. He's gonna hit me. No, he didn't. Surprisingly enough. Nope. Shot glove time. Kind of a waste of a shot glove charge, but okay. But I hate when that happens when you charge the shot gloves. I hate when you charge the shot gloves and you only get a little bit of use out of them. That's pretty annoying. But whatever, I suppose. Joker left us a little surprise. I've never seen anything like this. Or a big surprise. If you want to say that. These bombs are set to detonate December 31st. I should be able to disarm them with my cryptographic sequencer. Happy New Year! Seven... Now it goes down to 24 seconds. Dive out the window! these guys what the what happened there all right so the bombs blew up and yeah we got we got out of there just in time. Come on, boys. Penguins men here. Really? What? What happened there? Oh my goodness. Combat sucks. I've said that plenty of times, but I mean it every time. What? I pushed counter! Stupid man, stupid. Just get out of here. I don't, I don't need you. And you get it beat down as well. Get out of here. Heck away from me. Challenge map. Panorama. Challenge campaign. Cowardly and superstitious. Look at this. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Try to resist. And I'll kill them all. 
Here's to Gotham turned upside down. Come Xmas Day, I run this town. A plus rhyme. Fortieth floor. We got this hallway full of Joker cards. And it's actually the Joker uh, model from Arkham Asylum. So that's pretty cool. I have never actually noticed that before. Alright, swimming pool. Alright. Let's hang some guys upside down, shall we? Now. We can hope you're right. But only time to test your weapons. Now, um, when you have, I think it is, four guys remaining, they will set proximity mines on the gargoyles, so you have to have a plan to get out of there, you know, before you get to four. What I do is I attach a rope from that gargoyle to that one over there. And then I crawl on that, or walk on that, type rope on that, and yeah. And that's how I get around... And there's like mines over there you can set off. So you have to have a backup plan when you get to four guys or before you get to four guys because cause then they'll set mines on the gargoyles. So you got to have a backup plan before that happens. Alright, drop down. Get in there. I just got yeah, lose. I uh, just uh, use my last shot on that guy. And now when they're all dispersed, when they're when they're all dispersed, I have to hop out and put the rope, you know, like shoot the remote call to attach the two gargoyles. I have to do that when they're all dispersed, though, like on the other side of the room. That's the that's the best that's the best time to do it when they're on the other side of the room. Now that guy over there is maybe okay, but these these two guys or oh, those two guys over there are probably okay, but these two guys are not okay. So I have to wait for them to you know, when they get on the other side of the room, these guys those guys over there might be over here. So you you know, it's yeah, you you just got to be careful. You just gotta be careful, you know? That's, that's all I can tell you. Now this guy is kinda, now these guys, now those two guys are over here, like I said they would. I said, you know, at that time when these guys move over there, those guys will be over here. And look at where they are. So, sometimes it takes a while for me to Sometimes it takes a while for me to get an opening here. I mean, yeah, it will happen eventually, but it'll take a while. And these are Bane's people, just in case you were wondering. These are his uh, enforcers. And yeah, that's what they're called. They're called Bane enforcers. Alright, this guy wasn't right there. Alright, hook. Now we get back in here. Really? Alright. Do not go too far to where you go on the gargoyle. 
Or I actually was able I actually went on the rope this time. You don't go too far into the gargoyle to where you actually step on it. Really? That's the problem with this part right here. You can't go past there! What is this, man? It's garbage. Alright, just zip line and you'll eventually get past that part right there. Alright, so now we're safe. On the rope, you can't. The gargoyles won't explode on you if you're on the rope. So yeah, I wasn't. I, I didn't explode a mine on anyone this time. At least not yet. But I hung everybody up like I did last time. Well, uh, pretty much. Well, yeah, pretty pr pretty much hung everyone up like last time. But yeah, now we're safe up here. What I do is explode a couple mines, explode a couple mines on some guys, and then, you know, then throw a smoke pellet. That's how I do that. Yeah. And I would stay on the rope the rest of the time if I was you. Okay, he's coming over here so I can explode the mine on him. Boom. Alright, three to go. You are. Did you see that? What well, it? <sighs> you did you see that? It freaking shot the disruptor at the mine, but uh, I don't know what the frick happened. But the mine didn't go off, and that wasted a freaking shot. Are you serious? That wasted a freaking shot. Are you? <sighs> that is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. The disruptor in this game sucks, dude. The disruptor in this game freaking sucks, dude. It's the stupidest disruptor I've ever seen in the entire series, man. It's so, it's so dumb. Now you saw that I shot at the mine and something happened and the mine didn't go off. And I, I just wasted a shot there. What the... And if I restart, it's going to go back to the beginning of the stealth section and I have to do the whole thing over again. That is... Uh, that's the dumbest stuff I've ever seen. Ever. What the heck? Oh my... What the heck? <sighs> Alright. Frick this game, that's what I've decided, guys. That's what I've decided. Frick this game. Alright, let's lure this guy with a sonic battering. Uh, if this goes wrong again... If this goes wrong again... If this goes wrong again, I'm just gonna cut until it's done. So yeah. I'm just telling you guys, if this goes wrong again, I'm gonna cut until it's over. Like, I really do not care anymore. Alright, let's do a smoke pellet. Alright. There. Finally. My goodness, dude. That, that sucked. 
Challenge map, quiet waters. Challenge campaign, darkest night. So I'm sorry about the rage there, but then that was bull. You know, you fill in the rest there. That was that was crap, dude. First, I shoot the disruptor at the mine. Nothing happens. The mine doesn't go off, and that waste a shot. And then the guys, for some reason, see me. I don't know how or why, but they then that was freaking crap. That's all that was, a hundred percent. So yeah, that was. And yeah, if I messed, if that, if something like, if some junk like that happened again, I was gonna cut until the stealth section was over, and I meant it. I'm gonna have you guys sit through that again. That would be unfair, you know. So, so I'm sorry about that rage. That was just, that was just a piece of junk right there. That part, of, that part right there was a piece of junk. So yeah, I just had to rage there because that was man that was crap that's all that was 100 percent. that was oh my goodness that was irritating anyways we finally got it we finally got it done splash down finally did it now it's time to move on to the rest of the hotel at long last going up to the penthouse suite Jeez. Nice of you to drop in. And just in time. Is my parcel. <laughs> Remember. in my house to open one present each on Christmas Eve. Hmm. How about this one? I saw that or not. But the table we slid them across and all the things fell, right there they were back up again. That was weird. Alright. Complete 42% of the day base. Character trophy? Bane. And special combo takedown? Get out of here. Triple stun? Or ultra stun, rather? Gary the Trophy, Venom Bane. Ultra stun? Get him. Down and take down. Nope. So most of the time you have the red counter, but sometimes you have that counter. A 
Again, piece of junk there. Did you see that? Get out. Oh. All right. Some of the henchmen, too. I mean, to be fair, they appear so you can get your shot gloves charged back up. And the combo meter built up again. So that's why the goons are here, to be fair. To get your shot gloves and your combo meter filled, filled back up. So you can do special combo takedowns on them. That is a stupid fight. It is a dumb fight. Nope. Nope. Oh, just done. And take down. Really? I hit him. Are you serious? Come here, boy. Get out. What? No! I pushed counter twice. supposed to dodge that are you serious not fair like I said not fair whatsoever nope and again nope <laughs> Not today. Nope. Alright, we're almost done here. For you, Bane. Best advice I have for you is run and then dodge. And that's it, though. That's it. You just ran out of time.
Gate Prison. Welcome to Blackgate. We're going to do a quick psychiatric evaluation. Bad day, huh? Fighting as Joker here. And, uh. His control is a little bit more unresponsive, we'll say. Nowhere near as fluent as Batman is. If you don't take damage, thank goodness for me, right? Trying to pull out a gadget, are you serious? <sighs> Stupid combat. <laughs> okay. One more. And I need you to be serious for this one. Fate. <laughs> you wanna know something funny? I used to think of fate as evil. Predetermined, not by some higher power, no, but by the rules of human nature. Tonight, it's all changed. What changed? Have you ever had the feeling that your entire life has been building towards this one moment? Is that how you feel? <laughs> oh, yes. Now I realize. 
someone's pulled the stopper on my reality, and I'm sucked down the drain into something new. It's all very exciting, really. <laughs> you wouldn't know what that feels like, I'm sure. I might. Can you tell me more about how this person makes you feel? It's like meeting someone I can actually relate to. Which, believe me, dear, I've never felt before. <laughs> you understand. You're someone who's not afraid to let go and fall. <laughs> Free falling, and I didn't pack a shield. <laughs> You know what I mean? Yes. Yes, I do. I figured you would. So, may I ask, who is this person? Oh, someone very, very special. But whose real name I don't even know yet. Well, my name's Halloween. Halloween Quinzel. What a pretty name. Your friends call you Harley. Well, you can't have an Arkham game without going through this part. Pretty much can't have anything Batman without going through this part. Okay. Of course, I'd recommend testing it here in the lab before you go, but I'm sure you won't listen to me if you never do. Alright, gotta get the uh, training challenge Venom User Expert. Gotta get the glue grenade. Miles more useful than the concussion detonator, even though it looks the same. There you go. You can use this like the freeze blast to stick people in place. Scan the corpse in the GCPD morgue. Any luck digging up dirt on Enigma? I'm afraid not. He's very good, sir. Too good, mm -hmm. that. Don't sell yourself short, Alfred. I'm only being realistic. Listen, disable more of his powers and I can locate him. Then we won't have to search for information. We'll give it to you himself. I'm on it. Alright, character trophy, the Red Hood. Um, so yeah. Speaking of which, now the towers, the last two towers we can do. Because this one requires the shot gloves and this one requires the glue grenade. 
which we didn't have beforehand. So now we can do the last two towers, which I think I'm going to do at the start of the next episode. And I'm not looking forward to this one. This one is the hardest one to do because there's snipers. It's, it's the stupidest thing. But we'll do that next time, the start of the next episode. So this was a long one. Like I said, this was going to be the longest episode. And I was right. So before I end it, though, we're going to get some stuff here. We're going to get the special combo boost. You do, you know, five hits instead of uh, eight. And we're going to get the shot glove battery efficiency. So yeah, the shot glove strikes will use less energy. So it's very helpful. Next we'll get the double special combo move. Where you can do like a, two special combo takedowns or a dis, disarm and destroy and a special combo takedown. The battery, the, the um, shot glove upgrades, you have enhanced charge. They charge more quickly and you can counter stun batons and shield counters. Very useful. Very useful. So yeah. Anyways, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Um, it's the longest one, like I said it would be. In the next episode of... Next... Next time on Batman Arkham Origins, we'll be going to locate the tracker placed on Bane, and we're going to be taking out the next two towers. See you guys then.